So one of the most probably overlooked items in your, your little workshop or you, that you should have in there is this, this thing. This is a roll of stretch wrap. Let me show you a one that is, this is uh, the duck, duck brand right here. But it's a, a little roll of like cling wrap you'd use in the kitchen, but it's meant for things like we're doing right here right now. If you've purchased small items at one of the big box hardware stores, you probably have had them offer to, to wrap it for you. And what they would do is they basically take the little stretch wrap and they got to find where it begins. And this is, it will kind of cling to itself. And as you stretch it, it becomes even kind of more sticky to itself. Is that a good way to describe it? That's, that's, I'm not sure. But what it'll allow me to do is in this case, I've got six little boards and I can go and I'm just going to literally put my hand on it to hold it as I go around the first time. Now I've gone around, you know, just a little bit. And if I would go and, le and let up on it right now, it probably would come apart way too easy. So I, once I've gone around it like a time and a half, two times, so it's not going to slip, then I can start to put a little bit of pressure, not too much pressure, just a little bit to kind of snug it up. So you can see if you look is that I'm getting, and it's probably hard to see, but I'm getting a little stretch on it now. So instead of being six inches wide, it's probably down to about five inches. And I've gone around it three, four more times, and then I can kind of stretch it even more to the point where then I'm going to go and pop it off. So now it's done. I could do the other end. And what, what it allows me to do is just even with the one end done, they're secure and they're together and they're going to be able to be hauled much easier than having six pieces. This can be used in a variety of applications. It can be used in situations like you just saw me do here. I've used this where I've needed to hold a piece on to work on it. And I've used stretch wrap to hold a piece of wood in place so I could do some work with it and getting it attached in, in a spot where it was un, I wouldn't be able to use a clamp. It has a lot of uses. It doesn't hurt to have one of these around because they, they'll sit forever. I mean, they'll be on your peg for years and it'll still be good to use. So it doesn't get old, but it's one of those things that when you need it and you have a situation like this, it's great to have. And then when I want to get it, take it off, I can take a scissors and go snip, 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 or a, uh, a, a knife of some sort. Or I couldn't, if I really wanted to, I mean, I could peel the stuff right back off. It's not reusable, but it's not that expensive either. I'll put a link in the description below so you can go check this out. But if you're looking for a kind of a cool thing, you don't have this in your shop, but you're looking for something that could be a versatile tool to be used in a lot of different applications, this is something, stretch wrap is something you want to definitely check out. And some of you have used this in a lot of different places. Put it in the comment section. Tell me where you've used stretch wrap because I've used it in some different applications, but I bet there's a lot more ideas out there. The places you've used it, you know, I'm putting boxes up on the shelf. I've used this to close the box up and then it was a lot easier than having tape that ruined the box because we well, just had to go and take this off and get the Christmas lights out. And then at the end of the season, Put, it, put this back on and the boxes don't get ruined. This is John Young. Thanks for watching. For more tips and how-to videos, go to weekendhandyman.com.